Lisa and welcome to my kitchen. I'm Julia and today I'm going to show you guys how to make delicious, quick and easy white chocolate rudolf bark. So let's get started. I just have a brown knee tin here and what I do is just to add in some melted good quality white chocolate. Just spread it out. And then I just have small sugar eyes here that I am going to place those together. And then I'm going to use some red eminence. I'm just going to place it beneath here. And then I just have a little bit of crushed candy cane here that I'm going to place a little bit around, but not too much because I don't want to ruin that. Go look. Alright, so just a little bit of candy cane, and now I'm just going to place here in the fridge to set for about 20 minutes or so. So I just melted down some dark chocolate and placed in a Ziploc bag, and I've just taken my white chocolate mix out of the form but still kept the parchment paper on. And what I do now is just to cut a tiny little hole in here. And then it is time to paint on some antlers, just as good as I can. You just do it the way you want to do it. So I can really start to see these here take root of form. And I am just going to do this here with all of my Rudolph's faces here and then I'm going to place it back into the fridge for about 10 minutes or so until this here is nice and set and then I will return to you guys. Alright, you can basically just save it as it is and then just kind of break it into pieces when you want a piece but I will try to cut it out with um, a face on them all because I would really 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 want that but it can be quite hard because children have a tendency to kind of break on its own Now ready for the taste test of these cute little Rudolph chocolate bark. Mmm. Well, it's almost just white chocolate and then that little piece of candy cane on there. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I really hope you enjoyed this quick video here on my white chocolate Rudolphs and you don't need any ingredients list, but still write it down below. And don't forget to subscribe here. And I hope to see you back again tomorrow. Bye.